Good morning, DP. I'm Aiden Myers, here to give you today's morning announcements, so let's get into it. Kicking off with sports, our girls flag football team is now 2-0 after beating Buena 25-6. That same night, girls volleyball swept Buena 3-0. Our football team unfortunately lost to Buena the next day. Cross country competed in the UCSB Gaucho Inventational, where the girls varsity took third place out of five and the boys took seventh out of ten. And tonight in the Sovine Gym, Oxnard comes to take on our girls at 6.30. See you there, DP. This week is full of college visits, starting tomorrow with Westmont at the beginning of fourth period, University of Chicago at the beginning of lunch on Wednesday, Connecticut College on the beginning of seminar on Thursday, and NYU at the beginning of fourth on Friday, all located in the College and Career Center. Now here's DP News' John Hayworth with another look at this year's Fiesta. Friday of Fiesta Week is by far the biggest as people come from all over California to come see the historic Fiesta Parade. Before the parade, we got the opportunity to interview the old Spanish Days Presidente, David Bolton. The 99th anniversary of the first Fiesta is special. So much excitement is happening this year. We have our first male spirit. Jack has done so much and he's progressed so well. We have the four nations featured, Chumash, Spain, Mexico, and the U.S., and the entire community has come together. Fiesta is about everyone in this town. It brings family and friends together, and this year I think history and inclusion are the two things that were at the forefront of my goals. I was honored in April of 2019 to be recognized by King Felipe VI for my many years trying to help promote and keep alive the legacy of Spain and the Americas. I was honored to receive the, the medal, the medalla of the Royal Order of Isabella Católica. It truly was a special moment and something that I wear with pride now during our Old Spanish Days Fiesta celebrations in Santa Barbara. That day, we also visited the Fiesta staple, Mercado de la Guerra, which features shops, food, and dance. ¿Cómo llegó a este lugar donde está? Bueno, esto fue casual porque uh, bajé a comprar gasolina y vine a dar una vuelta y ya vi a mucha gente. Vine a pasear por estos lugares y vi que estaban estos negocios. Y como yo hago este negocio, pues dije, pues el otro año voy a participar. Y así empecé el negocio aquí en Santa Bárbara. ¿Y cuánto tiempo ha estado trabajando aquí específicamente? Aquí más o menos llevo unos 10 años. ¿Y cómo llegó a este lugar donde está aquí hoy? Uh, por medio de, de amigos, familia que ha participado en el lugar, fuimos invitados a ser parte de este evento también. La verdad es que ya tenemos unos años participando y siempre nos sorprende que la gente responda con buena actitud a apoyándonos a los, a los vendedores. Es muy bonito ver a la gente. Everything people like about Fiesta was put on display this year and truly showed why it's a unique part of Santa Barbara's history. For DP News, it's been John Hayward and Santiago Garza.